Jurak Dark does not know why he bothers sometimes. Relics are old. I do not guarantee their potency. Headaches! Enough for three! These people, they think everything is magic. They say to me, Jurak Dar, this ancient spoon is just a spoon. Of course it is a spoon. Aliens ate too, yes? Tell these people I made no false promises. What I sold came from Bellarata, yes? But not everything brims with magicka. Tell them, and I will share the way, the secret way into Bellarata. You will tell them, yes? See how hopeless it is. Don't believe anything that swindler says. Look what his garbage did to my brother. It's not safe. I bought the magic stone, slipped it into Elibor's pocket to get back at him for rubbing ivy on my bedroll. Not a minute later, he's struck by a bolt from the sky. But look at him. He's lucky to be alive. Sure, it's in my pack. I'll get it. Brother, no! Is that... Looks harmless, right? Wait, what's that tingling? Cat, I warn you, leave before someone dies. Are you all right? They're gone. What powers you must wield. Good, good. Time to pack on my way, yes? But you expect me to show you now? Not exactly. Juragdar did say maybe, yes? No? Such misunderstanding over a little knick-knack. Just a rock. How could I know what he did? Most of what she gave me was harmless. In the ruins? Bellerata? There is a ghost, yes? She thinks... Ah, hey. She thinks I am her lover. So she gives me things. Clothing, trinkets, things that belong to him. Most are harmless. All but dangerous? Never. Well, mostly. Fine, fine. Juragdar will show you. Come, follow me. I found this in Skyrim at the bottom of a lake. A sword with a poem etched into it. Also the name, Bellerata. It took so long before I found Bellerata. Well, let's begin. Our fates through the years are tied. A lover's kiss, not one denied. Our hearts awoke from blissful sleep, where battles break. And maidens weep. Away to war, not long to part, with sword enchanted by his sweet heart. A lover's bond forevermore, to keep it lover's heart in store. Too sweet, even for me. But what can you do, yes? Come, she waits. Hold a moment. We should speak. Before we go, there is something you should know. Last time Jurek Dar got out with the fur on his tail, the ghosts want her lover to stay forever. But there is a barrier with him. Beyond are the treasures of the aliens, locked up for centuries. Nothing like the trinkets I sold. The poem on the sword opens the ruin, yes? More scribbles are all around the ruins. Poetry. Spoken randomly, they do nothing. But if we knew how they fit together, we could open the ruin and share in the plunder. We'll enter separately as paupers, but leave together rich as kings. So, you will help me? She may not let you in, and there is still the barrier. No. We do not hide our sugar in one boot. We go in separately. Good. 
take this sword as a symbol of our pact. I want it back later. I will keep her busy. You figure out the poems, and when we get out, we will both be very rich, yes? I have returned, my love. My love? I cannot... Your sword, where is it? You are tired. Let me come closer. You are not Verondil. Get back. <laughs> You are not a Lanwe, yet you called me here. How? Still here after all this time? I had expected them to crumble with the ages. An old knight, Vorondil the Gold, they called me. I had lands, titles, slaves, all dust now. Even my love has forgotten me. A Lanwe, Lady of the Wheel. Surely they still sing of her? Her hair, bright as the sun, her skin, Pale as the moon, nine years we were together, happy. Then the war. I'd gone north to fight the uprising and died there. But she brought me here with words of life, but knew me not. When I went to her, she cast this barrier to keep me and all others away. I have been in this place ever since, waiting. Released from this nightmare, what else? Alanwe remembers only the sword. Its enchantment blinds her to everything else. If I still had the sword, Maybe. What? The sword? Give it to me! Were I alive, I could grant you such splendor. Alas, everything is dust. But I am forever in your debt. My head! I need a moment! Alanwe, at long last I return. Varondil? You have been gone only a day, but it feels like an age. Each day is an age without you. Yes, true, but you... where have you been? It is a long story, but come. Aetherius awaits. Yes, together forever, as was always meant to be. So long, my friend, and thank you for everything. My head thanks you for your haste. Once the barrier fell, whatever she was doing stopped as well. Truly, I am glad. She was very lonely and for so long. But enough melancholy, yes, two are spoils. Where's my catalogue? I must document my finds. <laughs> 